Welcome back. You are tuned in to Traders Nation. My pleasure to have with us here today best-selling book author, an international bestseller, by the way, folks, Sherry Harrison. She's with us today of birth when the spiritual and the material come together. Sherry, welcome to Traders Nation. How are you today? Good. Thank you. How are you? Oh, fantastic. Thanks for being with us. Hey, you know, there's no doubt. I mean, we're facing uh, tough times in a new world, and in some cases, it's not so good. So how personally, how do people get through these times? What do they need to do? Uh, spiritually, and then maybe materially. Well, first of all, I think you know when you say things aren't so good. I, you know, I always look at it as a as a, a wound that's being cleansed. You know, when you want to have it uh, clean and 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 new skin, right? You need to have that pus come out. So, so I look at all that bad stuff that's coming out as something really good because in the end. It's going to bring something better. So that wound, um, may, so that wound may be, like you said, needs to be cleansed. But there we have, but it's in recovery, right? Well, yeah. I mean, I, you know, like I said, it's being cleansed. I, you yeah. know, all the stuff is coming out, and then I really believe that, uh, you know, it's it's in our best interest together to to bring that good forth. Um, but it's a matter of responsibility of each and one of each and every one of us. Right. I, I don't think it's just going to happen on its own. Sure. I think so, we need to take responsibility. What about spiritually? You know, well, uh, spiritually, yeah. I believe that in order to make a difference in this world, each one needs to connect with themselves first of all. Yeah. Um, take out all of the layers of that are covering all of us, and reach our en- essence, reach our uniqueness, reach our inner peace. Sure. And from there, make a change for ourselves and for our surroundings. All right. What's what's the best path to essence? You you talk about that, and and even in purposes. Um, but some people, they just don't seem like they can find their way. And we all have a way, right? And we all have that way. And how do we find that, Sherry? Well, it, uh, it's a process. It takes work. It takes, you know, looking inside oneself. And I think it's, you know, a lot of quiet time, I think. I think it's taking, you know, even if it's a few minutes a day yeah. and, and connecting to ourselves, connecting to our inner voice and, you know, what our body is, is telling us, um, it's a process. All right. Now, do viewers need to understand that the path of life, lessons, as let's call them, uh, are rewards towards a betterment? And do they need to leverage these uh, to better themselves or to get them going, to get them back on that path, to find that essence and purposes? Well, I, I think in, in order to get on the path and in order to connect to oneself, first of all, you, you need to make a, a conscious decision and have that will, have yeah. that drive, have that you know, wanting to be there because if you don't have the will, then then you're not going to do it. And once you have the will and you take the responsibility, it's just a matter of choosing what way is best for you. I think what you know what's right for me is not necessarily right for someone else. Each one can choose their own way. Is it get, is it take key people to have around you to find that? I mean, to help you out because you know sometimes people do have a hard time finding their will. And I definitely think I definitely think you, you need someone. You know. Yeah. Um, it doesn't matter. It doesn't have to be physically another person. It could be sure. by reading a book. It could be by reading an article. It could be by going to someone, a workshop, or right. or going through a certain process. But, I, yes, I think we all need each other. All right. Now, you also wrote in birth that when, and I'll quote this, folks, quote, when we achieve peace with ourselves individually and with our surroundings together, we reach world peace, end yeah. quote. And I'm sure world peace is possible, but... I don't know. I mean, what do, you, what do you think? Because there's a lot of things going on out there. And is it entirely possible? Well, I, I believe it's possible. But yeah. again, I believe it's possible only if we each one of us take responsibility and reach our own inner peace. Because I think in order to have a transformation and reach world peace, we need to have a critical mass of people who reach that place. Yeah. Because it's real easy to have you know, a peace agreement, but that's not really true peace that comes from the heart. Sure. And true peace that comes from the heart only comes from within. All right. And if there was one thing in birth that you want everybody to know about, what would it be that we haven't talked about today? Well, um, basically to take responsibility that if we want to see change in the world yeah. and we want a better place for ourselves, for our children, for our next generation, right. then let's take responsibility, each and every one of us, right. to make that change. I think it's a great step. All right. The name of the book, of course, is Birth. Uh, Sherry Harrison's with us today. Now, Sherry, where can we get a copy of Birth? Barnes and Noble um, or Amazon? Or? You can go into arison.com, okay. www.arison.com. All right, now you have some uh, some uh, organizations you're involved with, too. Do you have a second talk about those? 
Yes, I have, uh, first of all, several businesses. Yes. Um, leading bank in Israel, uh, one of the largest real estate and infrastructure companies, water company, and salt industries on the business side. Right. And on the philanthropic side, we have a family foundation, um, Essence of Life, which teaches about, you know, the inner peace. All One, which teaches that we all are interconnected and we all should think and act from that point of view, that we all are part of the whole. Nice. And Ruach Tova, Good Spirit, which is a volunteerism organization which initiated Good Deeds Day, yeah. uh, which is a day that everyone can go out and have a, make a good deed. Very, very nice. And they get all that over at Arison.com? Yes, www.arison.com. Right. A-R-I-S-O-N is how you spell That's that, folks. Right. And all right, Sherry Arison with us say Sherry, sure. do appreciate your time. Thanks for being with us Thank today. You. Thank you very much. You're more than welcome, Sherry Arison. Get a copy today, folks. Uh, Birth, When Spiritual and Material Come Together is the name of the book. Barnes & Noble, Amazon.com, local bookstore down the corner. You can get a copy there, too. Support that guy in your local community. All right, very, very important. All right.